Hi, Bruce from Yoga Pros here. Today we're going to be having a look at the importance of setting goals and why it seems that some yoga teachers thrive while others struggle to survive. So, setting goals is vital. Think about it, setting out on a journey in your car. You've got to know where you're going. Without having that, you just drift around aimlessly. So, the most successful yoga teachers set out their long, medium and short-term goals. It's vital you sit down, get a pen and paper and write down what the goals are for the year. How much income do you want or need to earn? How many students do you want? What sort of courses or classes or workshops or retreats do you want to run and how often? How much time do you want to commit to the business of teaching yoga? The second thing is the most successful teachers recognize that they are running a business. So as much work needs to go into what happens outside the classroom as actually teaching within the classroom. It always amazes me when I talk to teachers and ask them how much time they commit to their teaching business outside of teaching the actual classes. And in most cases, it's next to nothing. Now, you cannot expect to get the best results if you don't commit some time to promoting the business, promoting the classes, promoting yourself. So, the number one rule is what sells most in any industry is what's continuously in front of people, not necessarily what's best. Let me say that again. What sells most is what is in front of people, not necessarily what is best. Therefore, if one of your goals is to grow and expand the business, it's vital that you and your products and services are continuously in front of people. Consider shooting some short video content that you can put on social media, but another great way is to have a look at different platforms and stages. What that means is you look at somebody who's already got a following, perhaps it's somebody who's doing a great yoga podcast, and work out what your unique story is, and ask to get onto their podcast, ask to get onto their stage or their platform. So now you're promoting yourself and your products and services to their clientele on their platform. So have a think about some of these things, try them out, take action, and see what difference it makes to your business.